congratulations my name is manjola today i'm going to show you how to make an amazing sri lankan dish shringhapan kattu Here I have a large wok on medium heat. I'm adding some vegetable oil, about um, two tablespoons. Once the oil is nice and hot, I'm adding the garlic paste. Until this. Now I'm adding the grated carrot. Keep mixing. I'm gonna cover and cook for a couple of minutes. Let's open it and see. I can see the carrots have been cooked nicely, nice and soft. And now I'm adding the leaves. Pepper, salt according to your taste. I like to add some soy sauce to give an extra salty flavor. Give it another mix. I'm going to make a well in the middle and I'm going to add my eggs. I'm adding two. Before you mix the egg with the rest of the vegetables, make sure it's cooked. And now I'm going to incorporate all the vegetables into the egg mixture. Now this is the best part, I'm adding my cooked mutton curry. As I said before, you can add chicken, fish, egg. It looks like a lot of gravy, but wait till you see how the string hoppers absorb all the juices and the curry from the mutton. Now I mixed everything together. and my delicious string hopper biryani will be ready to serve. Alright guys, the dish is ready. It smells divine. Can't wait to taste this. But before that, I have two special guests today to do the taste testing. My daughter Michaela and the very special guest today is Pastor Mohan Miracol. Pastor Mohan Miracol is my cousin and he's a very famous person in Sri Lanka and around the world. His work is mainly carried out in the most remote and difficult communities in the country and in the jungles and mountains of Sri Lanka, preaching the gospel of the kingdom of God. Shalom, I'm here in Australia on a mission to teach the gospel of the kingdom of God. Now we are going to taste this wonderful, delicious meal that my cousin has made for me who came all the way from Sri Lanka. Hey guys, it's me, Michaela, again. Today, my mom made the string hopper cup. Please don't forget to subscribe and like my channel. I'll see you soon with another great recipe. Bye for now.